I don't normally like getting up in the morning, but oh, Mr. Sun is shining down on me. So you chipped your nail, you stubbed your toe, you lost your phone. Life's a rolling stone on a broken roller coaster. Okay. It's all good. Move on. Throw your hands and move on. It's all good. Today is your day. Public speaking. Some of us love it, some of us hate it. But plain and simple. It's all about conveying a message that's important to you and your audience. We've got some hints and tips to help you on your way. Before you even start speaking, there are some things you can do to help you get ready. Firstly, preparation is key to planning what you're going to say. Think of a strong grabber. Did you know that? How would you feel if I said? 87% of young people that surveyed said that. Maybe you could start with a personal story or a question that gets some response. Whatever your opener, make sure it gets your audience's attention. Next, think about who you are actually going to be speaking to. Are they older than you, younger than you? Knowing who your audience are should influence what you say and how you say it. You've heard it said before, but practice, practice, practice. The more you know your stuff, the better your speech will be. As the saying goes, proper preparation prevents poor performance. Right, so now you've had a think about what to do before you start talking. Now we can give you some hints and tips on what to do during your speech. First step, mind your, uh, um, like? Mind your filler words. If you feel a filler word coming on, pause, take a breath, and then carry on. Smile and add expressions. Be passionate about what you're speaking about. If your audience doesn't see your passion, they won't share it. Wouldn't it be funny if we had face-to-face -face conversations with people and didn't make eye contact? Weird, right? It's just the same for when you're giving a presentation. Try to make eye contact with different people across the room so that it feels like you're having a conversation with them. Speak with an intent to move people to action. And know what you want your audience to do immediately after they hear your speech. And lastly, how you finish your presentation is just as important as how you start. Um, that's it. I I'm finished. So, take a stand, make a difference, and be the change that you want to see in the world. So, we hope these hints and tips have helped. Remember, practice, practice, practice. Start small and set yourself achievable goals. And we're sure you'll be a public speaking pro in no time at all. So, are you ready? 